In the video filter section, let's find the mask tool, which allows us to define the exact mask shape. A mask is actually an object that defines which part of an image will and which one will not be affected by setting this effect. Now let's apply the mask filter on the clip and look at its setting options. As the first step, we select the creation of the mask shape by means of points. Any mask shape can be created this way. After finishing, we need to decide whether the video changes will be applied within the created shape or around it. We can choose from a variety of filters and effects that Eduse offers. We can also soften the edge which determines where the mask is and isn't applied. Moreover, masks can be combined and we can use predefined shapes. An advanced option is working with a mask as with an object that can be animated in time. In such cases we'll use key points which define the mask shape and position during animation. An example of such mask use is the blurring of an unwanted logo on a moving figure's t-shirt.